Mike Fisher inside the Star in Frisco, where the Dallas Cowboys have just made two significant moves. Not unexpected, but nevertheless significant. Tyron Smith has been moved to an injury list. James Washington moved to injury list. And of course, by starting that tandem on the 53-man roster, as was the case 24 hours ago, uh, that frees them up to be able to be put on a list that allows them to come back from their injuries. In the case of Tyron, of course, um, there is discussion, mostly from Mr. Jones, about the idea of coming back uh, sooner rather than later. And that is to say, December is what Jerry talks about. Uh, I still view that as unrealistic, but again, carrot on a stick. Uh, that's one, carrot on a stick is one uh, visual. And then um, hamstring torn off the bone is another visual that you probably think is important too. And then in the case of James Washington, we know about his training camp injury. Uh, that was gonna be a six to eight week thing at the time. And so uh, the clock is moving on him and hopefully moving in the right direction. So James Washington can come back and help the football team. You already know about Michael Gallup and his status. We will give you a practice report as it relates to what did rookie left tackle Tyler Smith do today at practice. A little more than some suggestions might let on, and we will walk you through that today as well. Uh, we'll also talk to uh, we'll talk to a player or two, and then we will definitely be talking with uh, Coach Mike McCarthy, and we will give you a review of all of that tonight live, Fish at Six, here in Frisco with the Dallas Cowboys. Oh, by the way, go get yourself some CowboysSI.com, and thanks to you for subscribing to what we do here. You can tell it's the season because when we go to the helmet board, you get your star, you get your Cowboys at the top of the division, all lit up, and then you get this week's opponent. Where is he? Oh, all lit up as well. In Frisco with the Cowboys at Star, Fish, out.